Hello, my name is Dmitry. I spoke to a few fellow students at the Atlantic Cape Community College to find out how their professors and their college education impact their lives today and how they would change the entire world tomorrow. Well, it's changing my life because I'm studying for education and I'm going to build up into a professional job other than a part-time job. So I'm hoping that I can do well with a better financial path. It's making me more friendly and not so shy anymore and I really enjoy it. Like, the college experience is amazing. If I wanted money, I'd be a, a corrupt politician. So I just figure, you know, be myself and help the world as, you know, as good as I can. Before I came to college, I was very shy and a bit self-centered, actually. But once I came to college, I was actually interacting with a lot more people. So that shyness and self-centeredness kind of wore away. And now I'm much more charismatic and I care about other people. I think it's a lot about uh, self-responsibility because you have to, uh, in high school, you know, your mom's uh, ragging on you to get your homework done. and. In college, you're kind of just on your own to do it because you're paying for it, you know. So, a lot of self-responsibility. I had a, a writing teacher that she she taught me. I uh, can't really remember her name, but she. Uh, I like reading because of her. I guess we would read s short stories, and uh, I, I love reading now. N now that I've taken her class, but that was like four years ago. So that definitely helped, especially since uh, I entered college at 14. So I was really the whiny teenager then, and I really think that entering college early helped me with that. How do you think you would be able to change uh, America after you get your college degree? <laughs> it's not like I'm going to become President Obama or anything. Um, uh, with my kind of um, degree, I don't think I'm going to change overall America, but in the future it might change maybe a, like a little percentage but you know, <laughs> you know I think it's definitely changed me um, you know definitely for better um, in high school I didn't do too much schoolwork um, and in college that's not really an option so I kind of learned you know I learned a work ethic in college um, I mean it didn't change me for the worst too much um, mostly it's been good so I hope to keep it that way Mr. Jason he was a really cool English teacher he's my last semester in English oh seven Oh, right, oh, 070, oh, yeah, that's what it is. He was a really cool teacher. He helped me understand more English and how to write my paragraphs out and essays and everything. He really helped me out a lot. Communication professor Keith Forrest. He is the best professor at this college, in my opinion, of course. He has helped me see all of my education in a new perspective. He's taught me so much about the communication field and he's the one that actually made me switch to the communication track. So he has definitely changed my college experience for the better. Okay, uh, well with my finance and economics uh, classes I've taken, I uh, feel like I'm now financially etiquette to uh, not fall into debt so I don't uh, have the government bailing me out. So I think that's uh, something that, the, that I've learned from my uh, math courses. In college, I'm, uh, that's how I can change the world, I guess, is how I say it. I can uh, not be like everyone else and falling into credit card debt and all that other jazz. Miss McCall, um, she's an English teacher here. Um, I definitely like her. She is the only professor that has made me, you know, enjoy English ever. <laughs> So um, I definitely like that. And then uh, Mr. Garristed, um, he was a professor here uh, last semester. Uh, he's not here, or he might have a few classes, um, but I haven't seen him around. Um, I like him. He was the choir director, and um, I'm a big musical guy, so he was definitely a big part of that. My favorite professor is Professor Bullock. He was uh, my last semester and current semester uh, computer professor. And he told me to uh, better manage my time when it comes to work and social life. And I thank him a lot for that. Well, I'm going for a career in acting and voice acting with a goal to, you know, rise to the top as perhaps a producer. And I feel that if I produced, say, a movie or a play or something along the lines of that, and it got enough of a following, I could definitely help change the world for the better. Maybe in only slight 
little ways, but I think that that will definitely help, and it would only be possible through a college education. Well, I want to be a teacher, so I hope to, like, help the kids, like, I want to be a kindergarten teacher, and I hope I can un help them understand that, like, I don't know, like, help them learn better and everything. Well, I am a marine biology degree major, um, so I'm really hoping I can work for an oil company and, you know, kind of prevent things like, you know, the BP oil spill and a bunch of stuff like that from happening. I mean, I know that's a lot of engineering as well as marine biology, so I hope I can work with a bunch of engineers and, you know, really preserve a little bit of wildlife in the ocean.